one way to define weakness is uh, times of helplessness. So there were at least a couple of times in my wife's uh, and my marriage when she was very, very ill. Uh, she's, uh, uh, she's got a chronic illness, and these, these, uh, these years were about 10 years apart. Um, and when you're not actually the sufferer, but you are uh, closely related to the sufferer, there is a peculiar kind of suffering that goes with that. When you're not the one in pain, or you're not the one dying, um, but you're the, you're the one who feels helpless, and there's a particular kind of suffering that goes with that. And so um, during those periods, uh, and Kathy and I both look at this, uh, back at this, in those periods, uh, God gave us the gift of prayer, a, a gift of prayer that we still have that we wouldn't have had otherwise. Prayer together, um, uh, and, and, you, and everybody wants to go deeper in prayer, and there's all these books on going deeper in prayer, but there's actually nothing that helps you go deeper in prayer than just being absolutely uh, helpless. You know, from the ends of the earth I cry to you, Psalm 61, and that's, uh, uh, that's one way God's been faithful. I would say one other thing. You could also define weakness as my, 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 uh, my, my uh, weakness in my uh, ministry is that I'm not a particularly good, orga- I'm not very good organizationally. A lot of ministers are like that. You're, we're kind of prophets, not kings. We're good at talking to people, maybe even priests, but not very good at, at management and organization. And over the years, there were at least three or four times in which um, my ministry at New York City would have at least plateaued, if not fallen apart, um, except that God always uh, supplied me with uh, people who complimented me uh, and it was, and I was never even smart enough really to choose them. They were, uh, God in many ways brought them to me. So sometimes I've experienced God's weakness, uh, faithfulness in my weakness when he uh, keeps my weaknesses from hurting other people. And sometimes simply when I felt helpless, uh, he just actually said, I'm going to come near to you and give you a gift that I wouldn't, be, wouldn't have been able to give you if you hadn't been desperate.